and it did miss that one shot so as you can see that did help a lot I'm gonna go ahead and drop this turret over here and I'm going ahead and headshot that health standby over there up oh, I did get my turret interrupted so for that the astrodar must die um, as now I'm gonna be doing a, a rotation without a turret which can be a disastrous and I'm gonna go ahead and bring down this ash tartar and start the headshot down onto the hellish DMBI. And of course now I'm back and uh, that headshot did help me uh, take a brief break of where I muted myself, so if you were hearing background stuff, you didn't for a brief few seconds. I don't know if you guys noticed. And of course, going to be go ahead and working on the baby anglers again. As you can see, once I'm going ahead and doing all this, it is pretty fun to do in general. And the baby anglers are, going, in fact, going to go down, which they did right there. Meanwhile, Clem is, of course, running by and going, Oh, hi, here's where he's grinding. I found you. I found them. I repeat, I found you, to quote the Empire. Of course, he is going to run over and give me Archangel's Blade level 2, which is going to increase my crit rate by 4 and critical damage by 12% for 10 minutes. And give me Archangel's Light. Curse you! I'm trying to do a test. Stop buffing me. Oh, well, this is what happens when you're in a good guild like Amaterasu. A shout out to them. I'm shameless and all that. I think my leg shot just missed, and I canceled my countdown, but the countdown is going to be interrupted, which is kind of bad. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and rifle smash you and back up a little bit while you are... Uh, dazed, and then I'm going to go ahead and count down you and kill you. Oh, you're still going to get off a hit. Well, that sucks to be you, or at least me. So, oh, 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 oh crap, I accidentally shot the Ash Angler. Wasn't paying attention at all, so I'm going to go ahead and bring it down. You're going to die. You're going to die. You're going to die. You're going to die. Are you even going to hit me? No, if I really want to move away, you're not even going to hit me. You're going to die. You're going to die. You're going to spawn two babies. Those babies are going to die. I actually missed that incendiary round, which is a rather important thing. Meanwhile, Clem is grinding right next to me as he is moving all throughout Ashwood, killing all the mobs, as he is a cleric, and that's how he rolls, or she rolls. He is a he, but he does play a she. Uh, but no, he's not a tran online player because of that. A lot of guys do play girls. It's an oftentimes joke that, um, no, Clem, not right now. I don't want to party you. And it's an off joke that, um, uh, the there are no uh, females on the internet. The uh, guys are kids, and the kids are ladies. Or no. Wow, I completely ruined that joke. How does that joke even go? I don't remember. It's like, welcome to the internet, where the guys are ladies. Or no, the ladies are guys. The guys are kids, or something like that. And the kids are FBI undercover agents, or something like that. You know, trying to get you arrested for, uh, you know, being a disgusting and evil person. So my turret is on recharge. That was a very random tangent. And the Tartar is going to show up. It does not interrupt my turret. I did extend way into that Ash Tartar's territory. So I'm going to go ahead and leg shot it before it can dive underground. It is going to dive, of course, and cancel my countdown. And I'm going to go ahead and start hitting it while it is moving underground, as my leg shot does let me do that. And the Ash Tartar is going to go down. Meanwhile, my uh, demolition turret is working on the Chaotic DM by instead of the Ash Tartar. Uh, which is just fine for its regular chain. And I'm actually going to go ahead and get aggro of that bloody Vesper. Very bad of me. My health is going down. Why was I even firing w alongside of my turrets? And so I'm going to go ahead and kill this Vesper and then heal as I'm in desperate need of aid. I only have 13 seconds left until my uh, turret expires. But it is going to give me decent enough health. I did go ahead and solo that Ash Angler. Good job on the turrets. About half HP. And is going to expire in 3, 2, 1. going to go ahead and actually try to steal aggro before it resets. It uh, looks like I am successfully going to do that. Kill this blood-sucking Vesper, and then I'm going to have to do a conventional sit-down and heal. Although not really, as I do have a headshot up, so I'm going to go ahead and do a headshot. This is me being slightly reckless, but whatever brings in the dough and all that good old stuff. So headshotting the Hellish DM by it is going to head in critical for a 5700 instead of 63 like it was earlier. Going to go ahead and check my durability. My durability is at 140, 54 my rifle, 105. Barely going down on my armor as I have not died, but 154 dura on my rifle. Nothing too bad so far, not too bad so far. Going to go ahead, and I actually did cancel, cancel that countdown. Very bad habit I have of uh, animation canceling before that countdown actually does go off. That baby angler did hit me. And I'm going to go ahead and count down this baby angler and start running. And what I am realizing is that the fact that I do not have my Hawkeye buff on, uh, which is very bad of me to do, so I'm going to go ahead and rebuff my Hawkeye, and uh, I'll take a break at the next turret recharge. So looking around, looking around. I guess I'm killing this Chaotic DM by... DM by are the only parts where you really need health. And I get ambushed by the Tardar. Tardar, of course, being the evil thing that hates all grinders like me who are squishy. And uh, this is going to hurt a lot. So that goes down. The Tartar goes down. Or the Tartar will go down. 
and I'm going to go ahead and run will this kill me no it won't I think I oh crap I moved closer and I did die so that is going to be the end of my grinding bit um, and I'm going to end this video this is well actually I'm not going to whoops accidentally did end the recording all you missed was the lag of me uh respawning back here on crossroads. User in your channel stopped recording. I'm going to go ahead and repair and uh, compare the costs compared to uh, what I actually got. Now, I did get two Rubus and Cs, which ought to cover any repair costs easy in the auction house. Um, but first, we're going to go ahead and sell these extra bits that I got, and then repair and do the basic bits, and then see how much I can get off auction for those two Rubisons. So, mounted and heading back to... Uh, Ron Crossroads, or Ron, not Ron, but Crossroads, Ashwood, Ashwood Post, that's the correct term, and I'm going to be talking to Chris Wincock, the good student's owner, that I do endorse, so first we're going to go ahead and shop, 37, 37, 184, 8,000, 3,000, 20-ish, 30-ish, we'll say 30-ish, okay. Pair. So I made about 8 to 10k, approximately, very approximately, doing rough calculations while recording. Gonna go ahead and use my return skill and see how much that did. Uh, after the fact, I'm gonna go ahead and um, actually, I can do that right now. I did end right about the grinding was, and I'm gonna go ahead and check. And it's too many samples to add up. Uh, I'll actually go ahead and put that at Movie Maker before I end that, as it is what I use to compress my videos and see how long the grinding was and how about how much gold I made per. And then we can infer from there. Uh, but grinding is definitely an option for making money and, of course, for leveling, especially during 3x EXP, uh, which is currently going on right now. User Spammer, of course, going channel. on. I'm going to have to turn off normal chat for now. And I'm going to be... Why am I heading down to the bank? I'm actually going to be heading off to the auction house, talking to the sales agent. I'll block that person there after the recording. And we're going to be looking for other or item equipment reinforcement search. This is going to pull up all the Rubes and C's. Rubes and C's here going for about 90k. Uh, 90k. One. Or that's cheaper. That's 75k. That's 75k. That's 80k. We'll be nice and we'll, we'll actually sell pretty cheaply because I always sell my items pretty cheaply. I'm going to be selling these two for 120k, which is about 60k each. Um, which sounds about right. In general, I don't remember exactly how much Rubus and C goes for, but I'm going to go ahead and post that for 120k. So we'll add 120k to that, we'll add another 10k to that. So we'll, we made about 130k, and uh, bear with me while I launch this program that you don't see over here. Uh, adding, and slight lag as I am currently frapsing right now. Moving down the line and opening this bit. We're going to see how long that grinding session was up until the fact that I died. Uh, 24, 28, 30 minutes. All right, so that's about 30 minutes and 17 seconds of uh, grinding. Uh, so about half an hour of grinding made me about roughly uh, 130k. So extrapolate here, pretend that we get two more Rubisons and the next uh, 30 minutes or so if I kept grinding for an hour. And that brings us about to about 260, we'll say a quarter million every hour of uh, grinding, uh, which actually is a lot more than I used to think. Uh, Decentish way to make money, and now I'm going to end recording and add this to the other bit.